Boy, hello viewers and welcome to Emeka Williams Spiritual Tips. My name is Pastor Emeka Williams. If this is your first time of coming in contact with this face, welcome to my YouTube channel. Our YouTube channel, our family. Now quickly, like this video, click the share button, and press the subscribe button button to make you a bona fide member of this family and as you do so may the good god bless you and whatever purpose god allowed you to come in contact with this channel the lord shall bring it to pass in your life in the name of jesus christ it's a spiritual channel where we share knowledge on how you can use natural items to help yourself solve your problems that's it now to my returning subscribers my returning viewers double thumbs up. I love you guys. May God bless you. And to God Almighty, Baba, I bow my head in appreciation. Now today, I am giving another power pack. Why? When it happens, also Ghana, Mekata, Kata, Kata, in the camp of your enemies, destroying your enemies in few minutes with lemon. Does it sound weird? It might, but I tell you, this is tested and trusted exercise. Have they been giving you trouble? They have refused you to have peace. They've made life miserable for you. It is high time you stood up for yourself. If you don't fight, you will not recover. The Bible says right from the days of John the Baptist up to now, in Matthew 11 verse 12, the kingdom of God suffered violence and the violent take it by force. And I love one prayer that Jesus made in Luke chapter 19 verse 27. All those my enemies that would that I should not reign over them, bring them here before me and slay them. And in Luke chapter 10, verse 19, the Bible said, Behold, I have given you power to trample upon serpents and scorpions and upon all the powers of the enemies, and nothing shall by any means hurt you. Child of God, the question is this to you this afternoon. Have you been utilizing the power that God has given to you to defend yourself? Or have you made yourself vulnerable for any enemy to mess up with anyhow? In Jeremiah chapter 1 verse 10, the scripture said, Behold, this day I have lifted you up above nations and kingdoms, and I have given you power to pull down, to throw down, to uproot, to overthrow, to destroy, and to plant, and to build. So, use that power judiciously and enjoy life that God has ordained you to enjoy. Quickly, you'll be needing a lemon. You'll be needing a nail. Okay? You'll be needing a knife. And you'll be needing some dust of the earth, sand, dirt from the earth. Whether you call it dirt, whether you call it sand, whether you call it dust, you just know what I'm talking about. Then another thing you'll be needing is a black paper bag. Now quickly, how do you do this? Get your lemon. Let me adjust very well. The first thing you do after you have consecrated it and sanctified it and tell God what you want this lemon to work. You want to use it to destroy. You want to use it to end. You want to use it to rusticate your enemies out of your life. You want to incapacitate them. You want to discomfit them. You are the one that knows your challenges and your problems. So what you do is this. You get your lemon. 
Don't cut it like this. Don't cut it vertically. Cut it horizontally into two. Into two equal parts. Okay. I have the lemon cut into two equal parts. Then what is the next thing you are going to do in this video? You pack some of the dust and place it upon the face of half, one half of the lemon that you have cut into two. When you have done this, you are going to start praying and making your decrees. The lemon does not have a sweet taste. You say, oh, God, arise. Any man or woman that has brought problems, troubles, suffering, affliction, sorrow into my life, as long as that man or woman is matching the dust of the earth and walking, and that man is a product of the dust of the earth, even from the Adamic nature, today, I cover that man and everything that pertains to them in the midst or inside this lemon. And as this lemon begins to rotten, let every good thing that gives that man joy, that woman joy, that enemy joy, begin to rotten. Let their strength rotten. Let their bones rotten. Let their body, their skin rotten. Let everything that they hold prestigious to them begin to rotten. After saying that prayer in the name of Jesus Christ, I said, now you are going to take your nail. I'm sure you have seen the nail. You take your nail from up. You pin the nail across and let it pierce through the lemon. See, the nail has been used to pierce the lemon. Okay? Now this is it. Your enemy has been caged inside the lemon, connecting to them through the dust of the earth. Every power. Don't forget the scripture says, Behold, I, I have given you power to trample upon serpents and scorpions. Whosoever that has taken the position of a serpent and a scorpion, knowingly or unknowingly to me, that they do me, they pity me. They are the one that is afflicting you. They are the one that is still telling you sorry. Today, I catch you in this place. I turn your life to the lemon. As the lemon seed decays, let your life decay. Let everything that you stand upon the decay. Then after that, you now get your black paper bag. Wrap the lemon in the black paper bag. Wrap it up. And here it is. Now when you have done this, go and look for somewhere. Discard this. Discard it wherever. Let it go and decay there. Whether in the refuse bin, wherever. Just discard it away from you. And as you do so, I am telling you, by the grace of the Almighty God, you will hear scores. You will hear news of how your enemies has been incapacitated. Problems and tragedy will begin to happen to them. And then they won't have time to come after you again. I will be bringing this video to an end at this juncture. If you like this video, please kindly give me the like button. Subscribe to my channel if you've not done so already. Share my video to family and friends and your social uh, media network groups. May the good Lord bless you. Till we meet again in my next video, I am waiting for your testimony over your enemies.